I think first of all we're playing pretty good doubles. You know, we uh, we won both doubles points and kind of uh, in pretty convincing fashion. So, you know, we won five out of six uh, doubles matches. So, you know, I think we learned that. Uh, we also learned, uh, you know, we've got some points that are pretty strong. You know, Aziz played excellent this weekend, uh, as did uh, Terrence, and uh, Terrell played very well in his match too. So, you know, I think, um, you know, we got to continue to work hard and improve. And, um, you know, but I think uh, certainly uh, th those points are, are very good for us. I think it was a tough match. We were we prepared well for the match. We did everything to win. The conditions were not easy. A lot of win in a match, but I think everyone tried his best, and it's the most important thing. I think we we were really close to win. So it's only like a couple details that made the difference, and we're learning from this match. And I think the positive point is that we see that our team has the level to be like top 10 or even better so that's a good point for the weekend and I hope this weekend is going to be even better. Um, just the small details you know just keep um, applying the right tactics and playing the big points well especially with the no ad format I think those juice points are really important um, but just to have confidence in uh, you know our team and also in ourselves we were prepared really well we had a good fall preparation had good showing these first couple of weeks um, so I know we beat Alabama last year on their courts. I know they're going to come here with a lot of energy, but um, we love playing at home, and I think the team. I think the team's ready. That's awesome, and especially for you know most of the international guys in the team. Their parents can watch, um, you know, a home match at Florida State in um, all over the world, and it's uh, it's nice that um, you know ESPN3 is coming to to these to the Scott Spiker Tennis Center, and uh, you know credit to Dwayne. He's organized all these matches to be broadcast on ESPN and just creates a new dynamic and a lot more energy, I think, for the match. It's really exciting for everyone. Everyone is like really pumped to practice and we're like impatient. We can't, we can't wait to be on court and, and, and fight to and fight, give everything on the court. Yeah. Uh, I think, you know, Alabama and Troy are both NCAA caliber teams and you're, they're kind of similar to maybe a Mississippi State that we played uh, this weekend. They're a bunch of, bunch of good players, a bunch of guys that are ranked. Uh, Troy had going in the NCAA tournament, I think the most wins of any team in the country last year. Um, so, you know, they're, they're both very good teams uh, and, um, you know, we'll have to have to be ready to play and, and play like we did this past weekend.